New Worst Game 2023. The Walking Dead Destinies is the latest licensed game from Skull Island Rise of Kong publisher Game Mill. And it didn't take long for it to emerge as another worst game of 2023 contender. Link in the comments for more. Walking Dead Destinies. Oh, geez. Um, a worst game of 2023 contender. Oh, wow. Look at him. Jesus. Okay. Why do Walking Dead Destinies use Rark Grames model for their game? Jesus. Walking Dead Destinies is the latest worst game of 2023. That's amazing. An actual cutscene from The Walking Dead. Uh, 2023 is the best year in gaming. I haven't laughed this hard for a while. Wait, that's supposed to be like the guy, um... The guy with the rolled up sleeves, right? I never really watched, uh, Walking Dead, but I mean, I'm on the internet all the time. It's Rick, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I my dad's watched it. I've, he's talked to me about it. I get an idea of, like, who the characters are. That's just the best game ever. Game Mill has done it again. Oh my god. Let's see the launch trailer. Am I 17 or older? Yeah. It's been that way for a while now, actually. Now that I think about it. Dear Dad. It's hard to remember who we were before all of this. Who you were. It's... Well, that looks like shit. Who is this coming out for the PlayStation 2? God damn. Seems like a different life. One before mom died. You have to help us. What do we? Why don't they just use Unreal? What is this like? Dude, just use Unreal Five. Choose stealth. Bro, they can't even, dude. Dude, this guy's looking right at you, like. What do you mean stealth? Like they would easily see you, like. What is this? Oh my god. Choose combat. Oh, this is good. Wait, wait. Oh my god. Jesus, bro. Dude, you taught me that growing up is about keeping the people you love Wait. safe. Wait. People you love safe. Oh my god. A chance for everything to change and for everyone to have a real life. Dude, look at the look at the quality on this. Dude, how do you release something like this? This is amazing. <laughs> what the fuck? Dude, this could have came out 10 years ago and it would have been bad. <laughs> like, so like, what is this company? Is this company like some sort of like, so this is my, uh, this is what I think it could be. All right. So let's go ahead and put pieces together. This is the same company that was able to secure the IP of Lord of the Rings. What if this is a company that's owned by an extremely rich person who uses this company to release bad video games that get overrepresented or over um overvalued so they can write them off at a tax loss and that way they can not pay as much taxes and they're very well connected which is why they're able to get the IP for like Walking Dead and Lord of the Rings like that's the only way this makes any fucking sense it is. I cannot like that's it. That's got to be it, right? That's got to be it. It's oddly specific, yeah, but it's true though. Change and for everyone to have a real life. It's money on it, yeah. The things you've had to do. I want you to know that it all means something. That there's hope. Damn. Never forget who you are. Damn, man. You're a good leader. This is rough. You're a good man. Oh, dang. You're Shane Walsh. My dad. I love 
love you. Come. I think it's just so impressive to me that this says PS4 and not PS2. It's incredible how bad this is. Like, I just... An actual cutscene. What's this? <laughs> Wait, this is the cutscene? <laughs> Let's watch it again. I guess they must have made this game in PowerPoint. And the game of the year goes for- oh, here we go. Damn, got him. Got him. Bro, how many times? Most people call up dragon fruits on account of the This is some real gameplay right here. He pushes you back. We were brothers! We were brothers! <laughs> we were brothers! Oh my god. How could something like this exist? This is amazing. What's the resolution? Uh, this is recorded on a Nokia phone. This is an actual cutscene. That's it! We either take care of this right now, or we just gotta go! Now hold on, Shane. You can't tell me you're okay with this! Get your weapon- Look at his fucking face! Look at his fucking fa- Look at his fucking face, man! This is a game that just came out! But y'all, time to grow up! Shane, that's enough! You damn right that's enough! Yeah. Enough risking our lives for a little girl who's gone! Enough living next to a barn full of things that are trying to kill us! Damn. Enough! Rick, it ain't like it was before! It's not our call. We're guests here. The hell with that, man! The right choice is the choice that keeps us alive! Uh -oh. You want those things next to where Lori sleeps? Fucking mouth, it man. ain't hard, Rick. You can't just... I don't think you can keep them safe. If you all want to live, if you want to survive, you gotta fight for it! I'm talking about fight! Right here! Right now! Wow. This is amazing. Jackpot. Get away from me! Man, this is something special, ain't it? This is incredible. Daryl and Carol in The Walking Dead. Oh my fucking god. Um... It launched last week on the PlayStation 5. And the PC version on Steam is gonna be out on December 1st. Oh man, I can't wait to play this. Dude, it's- dude, this- this company- Hey, what's up, everybody? There's gotta be, there's gotta be something that we don't understand. It's a money laundering front. It's some sort of like, uh, you know, tax write-off for a rich person with connections in the entertainment industry. There's something about it that we don't understand because I will not allow myself to believe that this just happened on its own and they tried to make it good. There's no way that this was actually, like, nobody signed off on this and was like... <laughs> oh, look at that. Nobody signed off on this and said, okay, that's good enough. I don't believe it. I'm just not gonna- I'm, I won't believe it, guys. I think that there's something we don't understand. Yep, that's it. Yeah, this is- this game is 50, guys, 50. Dollars, all right. It's fifty dollars, and the creator of um, uh, no, not Gollum, uh, 
the, uh, Skull Island Rise of Kong. Uh, this is their next greatest hit. And to be honest, um, you know, there's going to be a lot of people that talk about it. 50 hours or $50 or 50 hours of belly laughs. Yeah. I mean, these games are just so bad. It's actually kind of funny. I'll, I'll have to give you that. It is fucking hilarious.